Well, I kind of did it off camera, but I apologize for not making an unboxing video. But uh, I'm going to do a review on that thing for you. It's a 2016 uh, Yard Machines 20 inch uh, 125cc 300E. I'm not sure what it is, but uh, this is a next generation mower that I. Uh, I used to have one of these when I was a child back in the back in the early days when I was about seven years old when I move in this when we move in this property that uh we need something new something something light and this is the one I get I got it from Home Depot which is about uh about a hundred bucks which is a cheap price on this machine but uh it's pretty cool looking, but it can roll easier. This is gonna be a one heck of a mower. That, but I, I mentioned the one I used to have, but I did have another one, but I had two of them mowers with sub propelled drive, Craftsman and the other one, but uh, I had them two for about seven and the other one for 10 years luckily uh, that other thing was uh running but uh kind of crazy on me but what happened is I, I still got it which is i don't use it any anymore but uh what happened it just the carburetor got really dirty on it it just starting ran away wide open and running wild like crazy and we decided to give up on it and buy a Craftsman push mower from Sears. And then about uh, seven years later in 2014 and today, I bought this mower. Which is a very good price. Some for me to handle, some for me to push. A lot easier. Heck yeah, but this is a pretty nice looking, fancy looking mower. I think I need to cut that off. Well, there she is. My 2000... 16 uh, yard machines uh, push mower. If y'all like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on the information bell. Click on the bell for more videos. I'll ha I may have a link for subscription if you want to buy one of these mowers. They're available on Amazon and Home Depot, which is still a lot cheaper. If you already have one, please let me know. Alrighty. I'll go ahead and wrap up this video, and I'll see you on the next video when I had it all gassed up and ready to cut some grass. So I may try to do that for tomorrow. So, uh, thanks for watching.